And how many, so we have at Winterville, how many uh, machines are going to be required to, to be at Winterville? I believe it's eight, but I'm not sure. Lisa's looking up there. It's ten. Ten. Ten machines. And in the past, we've had eight, right? Not sure. It's um, one for every 250, so. So, not sure. uh, my question is like, for the number of required machines at Winterville, at Lake Park, at Trent, Multimodal, at Fleetman, at all these locations. Is there the, the, the necessary space within the room to actually follow this model with uh, fidelity and to where ballot secrecy is protected, but also that poll workers are able to monitor, we're going to have enough poll workers able to monitor each area, uh, each voting like booth, so it for tamper as well? We're going to follow the law. If it says one for every 250 voters, we're going to set it up where there's one for every 250 voters. And we're going to use this format. Two things. One, I'm looking at our numbers here on this electrical survey estimates, and two out of the 20 polling locations have been confirmed as sufficient. Just two out of the 20. And four out of the five um, early or advanced voting locations have been confirmed as sufficient. So we're looking at possibly 18 out of the 20 that we don't have as a viable option for our election day. And um, the way I'm reading the statute, it's 21-2-281, uh, in any primary or election in which the use of voting equipment is impossible and practicable, for the reason set out in Code Section 21-2-334, primary election may be conducted by paper ballot in the manner provided in Code Section 21-2-334. 21-2-334, a method of, nom of nomination or election for any candidate or office or of, or of voting on any question is prescribed by law in which the use of voting machines is not possible or practicable, practicable or any, in case at any primary election the number of candidates seeking nomination for nominated or nominated for any office renders the use of voting machines for such office at such primary or election impracticable or if for any other reason at any primary or election, the use of voting machines wholly or in part is not practicable. The superintendent may arrange to have the voting for such candidates or offices or for such questions conducted by paper ballots. 